Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Lazy Susan. So what it does is it just rotate. You put your display stuff like figure, action figure on top, and then you press on a button and then it rotates. So let's go ahead and start the unboxing. So let's go ahead and start the unboxing. So I guess it's a, little, it's a bit soft because it's been out in the rain for a little bit. Um, so I bought this from Amazon. I will link the the link below in the description so you guys can check it out. So first thing we got here is uh, I guess it's a micro USB. So let's see what's next. Okay, so actually um, looks like it's a power brick. Okay, so it looks like we don't have anything else in there. Put that on the side and look like we have a bunch of different other color to color palette. I kind of like the black one a little bit. This one I'm not too sure, but maybe the, the gray metallic color is not too bad. So let's go ahead and take a look at the device. Looks pretty nice, like a nice white matte finish. Pretty nice. So we have a left and right button here, SR, ASA, not really too sure, I wish there was a manual in here, but I guess we we'll just have to figure that out, and I guess you put the micro USB in here to power it up, a 5 volt, I guess, and that's about it, and in the bottom we have nothing much, but it looks like there's a battery compartment here. So let's go ahead and I'm just glad that they don't put no screw to open this. I'm really like it when the company does this where they just have a snap on, snap off. So look like not really sure what kind of battery it is. But maybe let's see. I got a double A right here. So I don't think it's a double A. Yes. I'm not really sure, but I have to look into it. But for as of right now, I'm probably just gonna use the micro USB as the power for now. So let's go ahead and see if we can test that out right now. Try to plug it in, get the power brick. And let's see, plug it right over here. Okay, so green light's on. So green light's on, so that probably means that it's, it's on. So let's go ahead and press SR. It's moving slowly, for sure. So let's go ahead and put it here. I have a Sega Genesis game here. It's moving very slowly, actually kind of fast. Let's press the left and right button, R and L. Okay, so that's just basically s switching the rotation. So it's not the speed or anything. Let's press the ASA over here. Mm, that might be the speed. Oh no, it rotate. It rotate back and forth. Okay, so I'm guessing the speed is probably the SR. Let's press again. Okay, so the more you press on it, the slower it rotate. I actually like that, but I don't like the ASA ways it rotate back and forth. I actually prefer to rotate just one direction. So if you continue to press SR, it controls the speed from what I know. And you press ASA button, it just rotate right for a couple round it's like second and then go back to left and you press the button r or l here basically it changes the location the uh, rotation left or right so as of right now it looks pretty nice it does rotate display it pretty nicely i, I i'm pretty happy with it i'm gonna be showcasing some of my rare video game that's why i decided to get this you guys let me know what you guys think down below in the comment thanks thanks for coming by if you like my content 
like and subscribe